reportingkit.com and in this video uh, I will quickly show you how to import a uh, Windows game uh, from the polit.com website or your own port into the potty kit so you can play it on your Mac um, as you can see here on the polit.com website there are uh, quite some uh, some games uh, which aren't uh, added yet into the pony kit uh, lots of them are so first what you need to do is uh, if you don't own a porting kit yet download it from the porting kit uh, website or polit.com website from the sidebar here and then uh, you can uh, open the porting kit um, as you can see here the news tab but then on the library tab you can you have two uh, sub tabs the local tab and the server tab on the server tab uh, you can uh, find all the uh, the games available in the porting kit which are over 600 at the moment uh, the local tab are or the ta is the tab where you have installed all your uh, local installed games games mm. so first what you do is if you uh, search a specific game you will search here in the search bar and you see for example if you type Anno as well yes all Anno games are, are there except one for one and uh, Age of uh, Empires A hey, all of them are there so that's uh, very good but for example if you uh, say I, I saw a game on Paul Telecom it's called Code of Code of Honor, hey, no Code of Honor here. So, what you have to do is you go to that specific game page here. In this case, I already opened it, Code of Honor. You see, like, hey, there's the video, and uh, those uh, the description is old. So, um, what I have to do, well, you have to do is the download wrapper. Click on that, that button here, download wrapper. Save, we'll, uh, save the file into your download folder, and then um, you also need, of course, uh, the Windows game, um, which is still available on Gamesgate. In this case, of course, um, click on uh, purchase if you want to purchase it. Uh, it's it's needed, so. Um, if you already own it, you can use that uh, setup file. Extract the zip file from uh, the polyctol.com website. You see it's there. Um, you see that the icon is there. You move it to the desktop. You see the wrapper is there. And if you open it, you see it uh, still has a uh, very old wineskin version, which doesn't work in uh, OS X 10.11 uh, and above. So what you have to do is you go to your local tab, which is very important, and then uh, you can uh, click on um, Add Application. This is in Dutch, but uh, in your language, uh, uh, um, if you open it, it will be in English or Portuguese or in German. Uh, we've got four different languages uh, added into Pudding Kit. And then um, you go to your uh, desktop, and there you will find him. Click on Open. And there he is. So you click on it and you click on play and what you'll see, hey, this wrapper is old. Uh, you need to uh, update it to the latest version. Do you want that? You click, hey, yes, of course I want that. So you click on it and then you will see uh, that the windmill and you see that potting kit is fixing uh, that uh, that game because this isn't uh, a game um, available in the porting kit you won't see any uh, description and uh, trailers but it doesn't matter as long as the play button is there then uh <laughs> but you aren't there yet because uh, you have the wrapper now um, imported and um, um, you see here it's uh, OS X uh, 10.11 resistant but you still need to install the game so you go to choose and you go to that specific uh, download of uh, the game so 
So, um, this easy is, is it? It's very easy. So, um, the only difference between a normal installation uh, of uh, the game uh, on Pol Telecom is that you add it first into uh, into the potty kit on the local tab. As you can see uh, here on the local tab, you can up, uh, add any program you want, even a native Mac game if you want to add that, no problem. Then you have it all categorized, or how do you say that, in one place. And then you can uh, select it and then click play if you want. So in this case, uh, it's still installing. So um, be right back uh, until this is uh, finished. So uh, one moment. So, well, the download ready. You'll see now popping up the installer. I will quickly install it. But basically, this is it. It's just adding it into the porting kit, and then click uh, play, and then it will uh, uh, the porting kit will update the game or the wrapper at least, and then uh, you can install uh, uh, the game uh, into the wrapper uh, the normal way you are used to with a portal the com website at least. With the porting kit, it's different because uh, you don't have to do almost anything. You only select the game, you click on install. You make sure that the set of file is in your download folder and Porty Kit will do the rest. So, uh, it was done. If the installation is finished, then you can click on play and then uh, it will be done. It's that easy. But again, most of the games are already added into the porting kit, so uh, you can simply uh, search them. And then add them into, uh, and then uh, install it. Yeah. Finish the move. Oh, that's it. Again, click play. You have to set the correct exit file. I think it's this one. Okay, quit. Well, let's click play. Let's see what happens. Code of honor, I see here, so that's good. There we go. Well, there we go. Click play. Easy. And then you can uh, play the game as you're used to with Paul Dolacom. Delta Force game.
Whoa. Whoa, whoa, whoa. simply just, just to see uh, that it works. So, um, and then every time you want to play it again, then you click on the play button again, simply as that. But at least it is added now into the porting kit. So, uh, have fun. Um, if you have any questions or whatever, you can always uh, add your question here on the on the uh, community tab so uh, well enjoy and uh, have fun bye bye